Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to insert and edit text and titles in Video Studio Pro X6. So the very first step of adding titles and text into your projects is to first of all click on the title button which is in the center of the screen here. Now you'll see on the right hand side there are a load of different thumbnails which are preset titles. Now what you can do is you can take these titles, insert them into your projects and you can edit them to your liking. That's one way of inserting titles to your projects. The other way of doing it is to create your own from scratch and the way you do that is to double click anywhere in this preview screen, enter your own text, format it by setting the size, the color, the font face, if you want it in bold or anything like that, the borders, the shadows, there's so many things you can do. I'm going to show you how to edit a preset title and then I'm going to show you how to create your own from scratch. So first things first, I'm going to show you how to edit one of these. I'm going to pull one of these off here at random. So I'm just going to take this one, drag it down into the title area. And you'll now see that I have inserted it into the project. So if I play that through, you'll see what it looks like. So what I want to do with that, I'm going to change the color, I'm going to change the font face, and I'm going to change what it says, and I'm going to also have it in bold. So to do that, you just need to left click on the screen while you've got it selected down here in the timeline. Double click on one of these and you can change what it says. So the first one, I'm going to set it as welcome. And the second one below, double click and just remove what it says already. And I'm going to put to today's tutorial. Now you'll see that it has changed it, but they are now not aligned with each other. Now what you'll want to do is you'll want to change everything, the font face, the size and everything before you align them together because otherwise it will just mess it up again. So what you need to do is double click on it again, then you can set your face. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pick one of these and I'm going to go for basic sans light SF. I'm going to do the same thing for the one below. And then I'm going to change the color. So to do this, you highlight the one that you want to change the color on. You click on this color tab, which is just here. And then you can choose a different color from this tablet. So you can now see I've changed it to green. I'm happy with the other one above as white, so I'm going to leave that as it is. I am, however, going to change the size of these. You'll see it's currently at 54. I'm going to change it to 65. So to do that, click on this drop down menu and select 65. I'm going to do that with this one as well, put that at 65 and I'm happy with those colors, the size and the font face now. So what I'm going to do is align these again. So to do this, left click on one and then down here in the alignment area you can choose where you want it to align to. So I'm just going to click on align to center. I'm going to do the same thing for both of them but you'll notice they've now gone underneath each other. So if you select the one that you want to have below, and then with your down arrow on your keyboard, you can just drop it down a bit. You can also do this with your mouse by just left clicking on it and moving it, but you might not get it perfectly aligned. So I do recommend using the keyboard for this. So once you're happy with your text, that's all there is to it. There is more stuff you can do, which I'll show you in another tutorial. You can add animation to this, you can add different effects to it, but this is just the basics of adding a title to your projects. So that's how you can add titles by editing a preset title. Now I'm going to show you how you can do it from scratch. So to insert a title into your project from scratch, the same process applies for now as it would be as inserting a preset one and editing it. So you need to go on the title button which is here, and then you'll see it says double click here to add a title. So you can double click anywhere in that preview pane, and you'll see it's now allowed you to enter text into here. So I'm going to enter the same as I did before. There's two separate titles. Welcome to today's tutorial. So what I am going to do is I'm going to change these font sizes. So I'm going to change the lower one to 55 and the one above to 65. So select the one you're going to change the text size of. On this drop down menu here, select what you want, so 55. The top one I'm going to have is 65. So 
so just select 65 but I am going to change the color of these so the top one I'm going to keep as white but the, the one below I'm going to set as red so select that title go to the color pane here and then select red now you'll see I've changed the color of the lower one but I've left the top one the way it was so what I'm going to now do is change the font face to Arial. To do this, left click on it and then select Arial from this list. The same applies to the one below. And now all you have to do is align it until you're happy with it. So I'm going to align it to the center, align that one to the center, I'm going to make this one go above this time, and I'm also going to put it just to the left of it. So that's all there is to inserting your own title from scratch. For more tutorials, please do feel free to visit www.softwaretutorial.com. You can also view this channel for more tutorials. And as always, thanks for watching.